So now we're going to have a look at some recipes that we can make with the quinoa grain, or seed as it actually is. You recall earlier that we put it on the stove to boil, we've let it simmer and steep so the water is soaked into the grain. And what we'll see in here now is this has become really light and fluffy, so it's not uh, sludgy or, or um, starchy at all. So nice and light, and we can use that for a variety of different recipes. The first one we're going to do is using a savoury quinoa dish. So we put that into a bowl straight away. Now quinoa is kind of a nutty taste anyway. Quite unique, really delicious. But what we're going to add into there is some nutrition addition. And if we put in some peppers, and mix and match the colours because the more colour you have in there, uh, the more interesting it is as a dish. And we're just going to put a few spring onions in there as well. Give it a little bit of a savoury hit. We're going to use tamari sauce. Now tamari sauce is kind of the same as soy sauce, it's just wheat free. So it's gluten free. Don't need much, just a couple of wee shakes in there. Mix all that up. Mmm. Well that's fantastic. Then we have a delicious, uh, savoury tasting uh, quinoa dish that you can use as a main. 